Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food, and I am here today to share a recipe for macaroni and cheese pressed pizza. So let me show you what you're going to need. You are going to need some Italian sausage, and I already had some in my freezer that I had pre-cooked for another meal, so that is what I'm using. And you're also going to need some pizza sauce. You are going to need some macaroni and cheese, some mozzarella cheese, some basil. You're going to need green bell pepper and also onions as well. And then I'm going to be using mushrooms and pepperonis. And you're also going to need some eggs. So if you want to see how this comes together, stay tuned. So what I am doing is boiling my pasta for the macaroni and cheese. I'm just gonna prepare this according to package directions. And then in this skillet, I've got my onion and bell pepper. I'm waiting for that to saute. Now, if my Italian sausage was raw, I would have this in here too, but since it's already cooked, I'm just gonna cook this up and then I'm going to add my Italian sausage at the end. All right, so my macaroni and cheese is done. Like I said, I just prepared it according to package directions. I did cook it a little bit longer than I normally would because I'm making a crust, so I wanted it to be a little bit fuller. So I've got it here, and then I cracked my two eggs. I'm just gonna put it in my macaroni and cheese and give it a good stir. And I do have my oven preheated to 375 degrees. I'll make sure to include the recipe for this as well. So I'm just stirring it up here. And got my pizza pan. This is a 12 inch pizza pan that I've sprayed with cooking spray. And now I'm just going to pour the macaroni and cheese in and spread it all over. All right, so I am going to bake this for about 15 minutes or till it is a light golden brown. All right, so the crust is out of the oven. When you first bring it out of the oven, it is gonna be puffed up just a little bit, but it will settle back down. And this pan is very, very hot. I've got all of my toppings. Now you add whatever toppings your family likes, but this is what we like on our pizza. So I'm just gonna use some pizza sauce and spread it around. Next, I'm gonna take my Italian sausage mixture All right, so I am going to pop this back into the oven for about 10, 15 minutes or until the cheese is nice and bubbly and golden brown. So here is the pizza hot out of the oven. I ended up baking it for 15 minutes and then I just sprinkled the fresh basil on it when it came out of the oven. So here is the crust, a close-up of the crust. Doesn't it look good? It doesn't even look like macaroni and cheese. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. If you have not subscribed to our channel, I certainly hope you'll do so. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you guys next time.